Good morning. Good morning, guys. I'm under a bridge. Got a little sun coming up behind me back here. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's pretty cool looking. I'll try to keep talking until y'all can see the sun. How about that? Hey, there we go. Y'all see that? Pretty. And it's pretty out here on the river. I'm on the Ogeechee. The water is down, down, down. This is, I haven't been out here when it's down like this. This is the first time. So I need to be careful. I don't need to be uh, running around in places that I don't know. There's a couple of spots I already know I probably can't get to because it looks like it's down like four feet to me. Uh, but anyway, I hope hope that's good. And I hope to catch some fish today. And yesterday, caught caught a few flounder. I didn't have enough really to make a video, but I caught some fish. So uh, today, let's see if we can catch a few more and uh, just enjoy ourselves. Just, just enjoy what we got out here, okay? Enjoy what God has made out here in the outdoors, guys. Thanks for watching. First, some food of the morning. There he is. There he is. I've been hunting up and down this bank. I'm seeing a few of them kind of scattered here and there. I can't tell if they're suspended. These, as I got over here, look a little more suspended. He hit it on a drop. Glad to see him. I think I met him before. Not really sure. Maybe at one point in time I've talked to, I don't It's hard to keep track with all these fish and people. Well, let's see if we can get on something here, guys. I know one thing, yesterday out there on the salt water, there ain't no shade. <laughs> it was hot, hot yesterday. I think I got a little overheated yesterday. But I brought me some extra water today. And like I said, I'm more in the shade that's a good thing about fishing in the river. You get a little more. Not quite as hot. I think I got a fish on here. I don't know how I got it. I never felt it hit. He was just all of a sudden on there. Definitely a fish. Yeah, look at that. Look at that, guys. Two in a row. So that's what's supposed to happen when you crappie fish. You're supposed to catch one and then catch another one, catch another one. That's what's supposed to happen. I never felt him. I never felt anything. I was just reeling it in. I'm like, man, this thing's heavy. I mean, not real heavy, but had a bite right there. I might need to pay attention. Quit talking about getting hot and get hot. Let's get hot, guys. I started off fishing real deep. I saw a bunch of fish down there that looked like at 20 feet. But I didn't get no bites from those guys. Not one. But as soon as I got over here, but I've caught fish right here. This must just be a good spot, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. All I know is I wasn't catching them in 20 feet. I've had three bites in a row right here. Caught two fish. Let's see if I hit it like I did a while ago. But that last one that hit it actually is up there fairly shallow. I may have just run across a bunch that's feeding. There's a big old bass up there after something now. Big old shad jumping out of the water. I don't know if it's shad, whatever it is. And I mean, they were... I might have to go up to Cedar Town and get my bass fishing stuff bring it down here I mean because this is a, I mean it looks like a good bass fishing spot I've seen a few videos here and there 
people bass fishing. I know it's good. If it ain't good, it sure looks good. It looks like an alligator. I've already seen two big alligators. I know one thing, I got some big old alligators down here. Not as big as like Lake Eufaula, Seminole. Well, they probably are as big, there's not as many. Eufaula's got a bunch of them. Seminole, Lord, is loaded with them. All right, let's see if I can catch another one. What happened to my bike there? It cooled off. about bass fishing there you go catch a little bitty bass he's pretty lively little fella thought he was acting a little different Wasn't acting like a crappie been fishing here four or five times and I swear that's the first little copper nose I've caught the whole time I've been fishing out here and I thought I'd been catching them things left and right so that's the third species on the third color I'm not getting it locked in here guys I'm, it's kind of really weird Decent. Not bad. Not bad. I was just getting ready to leave. Now the crappie have all hit the same color. They've all hit that slider again, that Charlie Brewer slider. Huh. The bass hit a different color and that little copper nose hit a different color. Ah, oh. <laughs> That one popped it. Alright, both of those have been kind of right here. Still, let's just be still. Be still. It's hard to be still. <laughs> it really is. I probably ought to put this in that rod holder. Then I wouldn't be able to set the hook. It's almost like when you find these guys, you catch two or three, and then they get smart. I think I got. Uh, Thought it was a bass, it may be a mud fish. No, it's a bass. No, it's a mud. Dang it. Oh, I was all excited. Now I'm not excited. That's a pretty good little crappie. This time. I was lucky to get him in. 
looked like he was stuck too good. No, he's a, he's do the roof of the roof of the mouse, so he's in there pretty good. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. I like it. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Mr. Crappy. Alright, let's see if it works again. spot I was so convinced I'd catch one at I didn't catch one at I like this spot too though it's got a nice big eddy there's a pretty crappie all right guys I think that is gonna do it for me today um, fish some new spots out of the three new spots caught fish in one which is about to be expected um, so I did find a new place to fish that's good and um, just kind of learning as I go here with this um, the tide is really, it's a really big tide swing today. And uh, so when that tide started coming in, the water went up real, real quick. And I don't know, you know, I may should have been out here a little bit earlier, but you know, we'll see. Uh, but anyway, thanks for watching. I had a good time, uh, you know, caught a couple of decent crappie there. And uh, we'll just kind of keep plugging along, man. Thanks for watching, guys.